This disease is a pandemic. As a government, we are continuously improving our level of response to mitigate our rate of infections. I'm deeply saddened that a section of Kenyans have taken to social media to make mockery of some of these efforts. Yesterday, I informed you about our two young people who have recovered from this, this deadly coronavirus disease. However, some have deliberately decided to trivialize our efforts and in so doing, trivialize two Kenyans. Instead of people re-energizing their efforts and raising alert levels, it is shocking that some have decided to make fun and brand our effort as a PR exercise. Really? A PR exercise? Why would a government, in collaboration with the World Health Organization and other intergovernmental organizations, international organizations, decide to make a PR exercise with two innocent Kenyans? It is unpalatable. It is a cake and retrogressive for anybody to trivialize the lives of Kenyans, even one Kenyan. And I condemn in the strongest terms any person who would attempt to do so. I appeal to the media not to slight these matters. And I appeal to our enforcement agencies to arrest social media users. It is wrong and it should not happen. The current global reality is that close to one million people have so far been infected and 47,000 people have lost their lives. As we speak, Italy has recorded 110 574 cases with 13,155 deaths. Spain has recorded 104, 118 cases with 9,387 deaths.